Uh, I saw on the cover of Toronto Life, the community of the future, and it's a condominium tower. And um, not for me, honey. I have no desire to live in a 35-story tower. And they say, oh, your kids can live here. It's like, no, I don't want my kids living in a 35-story tower. You know, one floor has got a little playroom for the... No, that is not what children need. Children need green space, parkland, vast tracts of land. They probably should have a place where they can go ride a horse. They need to have a, a place to go skiing, tobogganing, uh, play soccer, play baseball. They need to have lots of space. And it needs to have lots of greenery. Not one of these towers in Toronto. That's a nightmare. It's a nightmare. And if that's what Toronto life is, I don't want nothing to do with you, Toronto. And if you're living in Toronto, I feel very sorry for you. You're not living like a human should live. These little box apartments stack one upon each other. Uh, no, this is stupid. It's a very poor thing. And no one wants to talk about how much they're going to charge you for one of these little storage bin places that they put you in and called a condominium. Unbelievably expensive. For the privilege of living there, you're insane. You're insane. Uh, move to a small town far away from Toronto where you can have um, some greenery. In any event, that is my commentary on living in a tower. Uh, don't do it. Don't uh, put your children into it either. Living in a city, uh, no. The whole idea of city living is um, not for me.